Devin Campbell-Tiana. Devin Campbell-Tiani was one of 11 graduates to walk the stage Friday for a driving diversity graduation ceremony at Aero Sanitary Service. Today feels amazing. Like this, I could have never imagined. Devin was unemployed because of the pandemic before hearing about the program. I was looking for something that was going to be beneficial to my kids and um, help me create the life that I want. Next up, we have Francis Ogala. The driving diversity program trains and places low-income Portlanders into recycling and waste hauling careers. These careers start around $50,000 per year with benefits. Participants include people who lost their jobs, parents who haven't been able to work due to lack of child care, and people impacted by homelessness. We developed this program with ARPA dollars, the American Rescue Plan Act dollars to help job seekers in the city of Portland as well as businesses looking for jobs to navigate the economic impacts of the COVID-19 pandemic. Mayor Ted Wheeler spoke to the third graduating class of the program which started just under a year ago. I appreciate these companies hiring more graduates and launching them into great careers. The program is a partnership between 11 recycling and waste hauling companies in the city. They end up hiring many of the graduates after the 12-week training course. And this was my first time ever being behind the wheel of an 18-wheeler plus jump truck. So to be able to um, learn so many different components and be so focused and determined, um, it was just a great opportunity for me. An effort to diversify the recycling and waste industry while creating opportunities. I am pretty much unstoppable at this point. I can do anything that I set my mind to and I am just looking forward forward to the next steps in my life. To learn more about the program or check if you qualify, visit worksystems.org. I'm Christelle Kumwe for KGW News.